the basic problem of the polarization of the parties, the, and particularly the extremes of the parties, uh, with much of the Republican uh, contingent saying no revenues, no how, no way, even with reform of the tax code. A very small crack in that with the Toomey proposal uh, a week or so ago, but not a big crack. Uh, and on the other side, uh, a lot of Democrats uh, saying uh, no changes uh, that would affect Medicare beneficiaries uh, or Social Security recipients um, ever. Uh, those are very difficult uh, positions since actually we have to do both those things. Mm -hmm. Uh, but uh, I think there was a failure of leadership. If the, if the leadership, including the president, had really wanted this to happen, I think they could have made it happen. But they couldn't sell it to their caucuses. Uh, they went back and tried to, uh, and uh, the answer was, uh, was no. We're not from the Republicans. We're not voting for tax increase. Uh, not enough of us. And uh, from the Democrats, we're not voting for uh, entitlement cuts. So uh, uh, we are where we are. I think there's lots of uh, blame to spread around. I think the business community could have done a better job. Uh, maybe the uh, wonky community, well represented here, could have done a better job. Uh, but somehow we, uh, we failed. Now, the consequences are pretty serious, uh, I think. Uh, we may not have a market meltdown because we're the only game in town. The Europeans are doing worse. I would expect an equity market reaction, but not much bond market reaction in the near term. We may get a downgrade. Uh, but the really important thing is we've missed a big opportunity to fix not only the long-run problem, but some short-run problems. Uh, we need to extend the payroll tax. Uh, we need more uh, the, to extend the unemployment uh, benefits. And uh, those would have been easy to fold into a big deal. Uh, along with some other things like uh, the uh, so-called doc fix. Uh, now those have to be done separately and may not be done at all. So uh, those of you who know me know that I'm generally an optimist. I am not an optimist today. I think this is a very serious defeat.